everyone my name is Vic of EU's market base and in this video I am going to share with you once again the updates on the newsletter today alright so um, with that being said let's start okay so here's the newsletter that the subscribers will receive or received some hours ago okay so here's the um, news update today so EOS a top performing cryptocurrency in a bearish market all right so let's read so that we can understand further what the news update is okay so despite criticism for being somewhat centralized EOS is one of the best performing altcoins surging around 40 percent over the weekend on Friday it was trading as low as 1.55 against the US dollar and reached a high of 2.17 by Sunday afternoon. Um, currently trading at 2.07 at Bitfinex. Okay, the move seems spurred by technical factors rather um, than something major on the news wire. Although it can be argued that a possible Coinbase listing for EOS is the reason behind the climb, but on the other hand, around about 30 other coins are eyed for listing by the San Francisco based giant okay and none of them have seen such solid gains okay so here's the chart analysis for EOS USD pair right so here's the uptrend on the EOS chart okay so they're forming high lows all right so the bullish price action seen over the weekend looks healthy and sustainable the pair is printing higher highs and higher lows on the early chart above. And the 20 period exponential moving average, or the blue line here, mm -hmm. has crossed above 50 period exponential moving average, the red line, suggesting that more upside movement may follow. Okay. So the first barrier um, in front of the rising price is the high achieved over the weekend at 2.17 while support is represented by the bullish trend line seen on the chart. A break of 2.17 will open the door for the big hurdle at 2.50 but before that can happen we will probably see a retracement lower or a period of sideways movement. The travel to 2.50 will probably take more than a day okay so the support zone is bullish trend line the resistance zone is 2.17 dash 2.20 most likely scenario break of resistance and move higher until the RSI enters overbought the alternate scenario break of bullish trend line followed by a bearish EMA cross Okay, so that is the main update for today and as you can see EOS our beloved EOS is performing very very well Okay, so guys um, As you can see um, the top Crypto uh, top update crypto update today is very very nice and just subscribe at preferredcurrency.news to receive this Newsletter, right? So the next newsletter is the news update rather is this one Mm-hmm so crypto market update tezos gets hobby listing eos flips bitcoin cash so crypto markets are, st are still in decline bitcoin cash sv is still dropping tezos bouncing back so crypto markets are still on the floor today as there has been no sign of even a minor recovery the bears have keep the pressure on the prices are st are still sinking as total market capitalization continues to fall below 110 billion Bitcoin has slid back again falling close to 3,400 down 3% or so from a high of 3,530 it reached yesterday BTC is down 11% from the same time last week when it traded above 3,800 and is dangerously close to hitting another 2018 low alright so Ethereum is still flat with very little ongoing a uh, little going on as it remains just below $90 for another day. The top 10 is mostly in the red, but loses are much smaller than previously. Okay, Bitcoin Cash has taken the biggest hit again of 3% as it slides into oblivion. 
below $100. This has enabled EOS to flip it and take 6th spot and with minor gain on the day to 1.90. There has been very little movement for the rest of the altcoins in this section. Okay, So the top 20 is a mixed bunch of half red, half green. Dash, Zcash and NEM are still falling back slightly but the big mover at the moment here is Tezos so which has jumped 6% on the day a listing on Hobi Global yesterday's driving momentum for XTZ okay mm -hmm. XTZ alright so there are a couple of altcoins in the top 100 getting a close of FOMO at the moment and they include 10x climbing 17% followed by Bitcoin private and DEX up 40% Waves also in double figures getting bashed today is Raven and Factum both losing around 12% at the time of writing Total crypto market capitalization has shrunk again today falling marginally to 108 billion around 4 billion has been lost over the past few hours as markets did make a minor recovery late yesterday. Since the same time last week, crypto markets have lost 12% and downward pressure is still strong. FOMO moments is a section that takes a daily look at the top 20 altcoins during the current trading session and analyzes the best performing ones, looking for trends and possible fundamentals. Alright? So, okay, so. EOS is now on 6th spot uh, because as you can see Bitcoin Cash is getting the um, most hit right okay as you can see here he has a, it has a 3% um, decline yesterday right so um guys as usual let's scroll down our newsletter or this newsletter rather okay so here's a, here's the link again so it's called um use marketplace and marketplace.pcn.today so these are marketplace websites where you can buy and sell different items using cryptocurrencies okay also follow up uh, at preferred crypto so this is their um twitter account okay so here is the main um, update today so this is Don the Guru's research list so these are the top coins for today so these are Dogecoin, Lunir, Nexus, Omisigo, Wax, EOS, Monero, Smartlands, Waves, and Zcash okay so these are the top coins that you should include in your research list and once you open, um, click this button, you will re be, I mean, you will be redirected to this, to redirected to this page. Okay, so as you can see here, um, here's the technical analysis of the coins or all the coins rather, and which is very very useful. And guys, um, as you can see, um, stay away from the red ones here. This one. Okay. Because these are showing the best, um, the bad news or the negative news, and the ones that you should be including in your research list or in your portfolio are the ones that are colored in blue. Okay, so let's check out EOS, for example. All right, so here it is. So, guys, as you can see, it's showing good news. Okay, so. To receive that spreadsheet, all you have to do is just to subscribe at preferredcurrency.news. This is only for $15 a month or $180 a year, guys. Um, it's very, very nice and it's just for $0.50 cents a day. Such a very, very little bargain, okay? So, guys, um, subscribe now, all right? So here are also other information, okay? So different lists of high volume change tokens or coins, interesting technical price action, 
the high weekly trade volume and the high Google search activity and of course a blockchain activity matrix and here is the main update of the day so here is also okay so here's the main update rather <laughs> and here's another update so here's um, uh, the affiliate program so if you want to earn cryptocurrency each month um, by um, um, joining the affiliate program you can earn affiliate commissions for seven levels deep and do here him do blogs okay here it is to earn crypto each month all right and also as usual um the upcoming eos airdrops that are nearing its drop date so as you can see here the parts of the war drop tuk tuk snow drop and the candidate eos.io and also if you want to um see the full list of the tokens and coins visit eosdrops.io okay so here is a website and you can just click drop date twice all right so here are the call um the the airdrops that are nearing its drop date so Lumius, Gibbonation, and Angel Wings, and of course, Caddios. Okay, mm -hmm. so guys, what are you waiting for? Subscribe now at Preferred Currency Now News to receive this newsletter. All right, okay, so here's the website Preferred Currency Now News. Okay, so once you see this one, here it is. Preferred currency dot news. Okay, so all you have to do is just to click Coinbase if you're going to pay in crypto, and also if you're going to pay in fiat, um, click PayPal. All right. So, guys, I think that's it for today. Um, before I go, just a short disclaimer. Um, I just, I just want to say that I am not a financial advisor. And everything I say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. So you must always do your own research before deciding for yourself, alright? So um, guys, um, this has been Vic, bringing you the latest updates on cryptocurrencies today. And guys, smash that like button and subscribe. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.